Okay, so for this tutorial, this is the pump I'm going to be blinging. I got it on clearance for $5, and I want to add glitter all over. And with this zebra pattern, it's going to take a little time because you're going to want to put glue just on all the black, and then put the glitter, and then do, go and do all the white after that. So it's going to take some time, but it's going to be worth it. So you need a pair of shoes, and mine have like a cloth texture at the top. I got some glitter, black, and then I have some fabric fusion glue, and I also have this iridescent glitter, and you're going to need some paint brushes, and I use this kind of paint brush, and you're going to want to put paper down. I already started one shoe, so I'm going to show you. So I have my newspaper down, and here's my pump right there, so that's what it's starting to look like, and it's looking super cute. Stay tuned, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. And then I'll show you my end result. Okay, so I'm going to take my paintbrush and I'm going to dip it in some of the fabric glue. I do and just, you know, get it so it's not too much because you don't want it to get that much on the white. I mean, it's really not going to matter once you add the glitter. And what you're going to do is just go to the shoe and you're going to just paint it on the stripes. And I'm doing all the black stripes first and then I'm going to wait for those to dry and then I'm going to do all the white ones. So here, I'm just going to paint it on. And doing it this way is going to take more time. Like on some other shoes, if you were going to just do one color, it would be a lot faster. But I really like these um, animal print zebra shoes. And so I decided I was going to do these to them, knowing that it was going to take a little longer than the other ones. Okay, now I'm just going to show you sh this one stripe. So once you put it on, just set your brush down, take your glitter, and just shake it on. And have some newspaper underneath, because when it drops, then you can reuse it. And do it like that. Put it on the sides. And there you go. Okay, so I finished the first shoe and I did all the black and they came out super, super cute. So I'm going to let these dry for a few hours and then I'm going to do the white glitter. And if you really don't want to, you don't have to because they look just cute as is. There's the shoe. Glittery. Yay. Now you're going to repeat the same thing to your second shoe. And I'm going to put the glue on the black stripes first. Okay, so these are the finished shoes with just the black glitter. And they're both done. See? And now I'm going to fill in the white spots with the white glitter. But you don't have to. You can keep them like this because they still look super, super cute. Just like that. See? There it is. So I repeated the steps using the white glitter and I finished both shoes. Um, and they're both done. So this is what they're going to look like after you get all the glitter. They came out really cute. They just took some time. Um, the one thing that you can do afterwards too is to buy a can of the aerosol spray glue and spray it all over the outside of the shoes. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Thank you for watching. Make comments, subscribe. See you later. Bye.